Okay, I only have four tries to get this right. <laughs> okay, here goes nothing. Okay, now I just gotta drop it in the fire. Here we go. Um, let's stick it right down there. Oh man, it went out. Here we go again. I'm gonna set it right, right here. Hopefully it doesn't burn out. It's still on fire. This is so fun! <laughs> oh, it burned out too! Okay, I only have two more matches. Gotta try it. Willow, what are you doing? Oh, hi Kalani Star. I'm playing with, uh, I'm making a fire because, uh, I can and I'm really good at it. Willow, you're not supposed to do, touch the matches or do anything with fire. Oh my goodness, I'm like a pro. Don't even worry about it. Leave me alone, Kalani. No, Willow. It's really important that you listen to me right now. I am not trying to be bossy, but I just gotta tell you a couple things. Babies are not supposed to play with fire or matches or anything like that. One time, Mom made a fire and it was a windy day and the flames got really high and they were moving all around and they almost caught the house on fire. Well, I'm not Mom and I'm good at making fires, so don't worry about it. I'm serious, Willow. It's really important that you don't you don't do this right now. I'm not trying to be mean or bossy, but I'm gonna go get mom. Okay, do whatever you want. I don't care. I'm good at this stuff. Okay, I'm getting her. Oh, hey, mom. I know you told us not to bother you unless it was an emergency, but I've got an emergency, mom. What's wrong? Mom, Willow is playing with matches and she's not listening to me. I told her it's really dangerous and that I was going to come get you and I wasn't trying to be bossy to her. But she wouldn't listen to me, so I told her I would come tell you and get you. Oh, snap. Thank you for telling me, Kalani Star. Where's she at? She's in the backyard. Okay, let's go. See, Mom, I told you. She's right there. Absolutely not, Willow. That is not okay. Do you know why that's not okay, Willow? It's fine, Mom. I know how to do this. Willow, did you know it takes just one match to burn down our entire house? Not only that, you could be, you're putting your family and your siblings in danger by playing with fire. And even though you're doing it in a fire pit, which that's a good place to make a fire, if you're trying to, uh, like, roast marshmallows, you should never, ever, ever play with hey fire. Girls, I know you're not in trouble, um, Kalani Star, but I want to talk about why it's not good to play, play with fire when you're a kid. So, Kalani Star, I'm going to ask you a question and answer it the best way you can, okay? Okay, Mom. Why is fire a good thing? Fire is a good thing because you can cook food with it and in a contained uh, situation. And fire is good for when you're camping and you're cold and it's a form of warmth. Oh, and it's a form of light if you don't have light. Yeah, that's very good. Okay, Kalani, I'm going to ask you another question. Why is fire bad? Fire is bad if it gets into the wrong hands. Fire, um, if not used correctly, can burn things down. It can burn anything down. Fire is no respect respecter of people that don't respect it. Fire will burn, can burn you, your skin. It can burn your favorite toys. <laughs> That'd be so sad, Mom. What if the fire burned Lammy? That'd be horrible. Yeah, that would be sad if Lammy got burnt. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry, Mom. I'm getting too emotional. Okay. Fire can burn down your whole entire house and make it so you don't have a home to live in. It can burn down your cars and anything that's wood. That's why it's not good to play with fire. It can be very dangerous, but it can be very helpful. That's why we leave it to the moms and dads and the old old people with gray hair and the people that wear um, old uh, big glasses and the people that have big hairy arms and um, the people that have babies and the people that drive cars. They can all use fire because they're smart and they know how to uh how to use the fire flames so willow do you understand a little bit more why you shouldn't play with fire especially by yourself i wasn't playing with the fire i was using it for warmth like kalani star was saying you can use it for how would you put a fire out if it got out of control i would blow on it i'd go i'd go <sighs>
Okay, so you can do that to your your birthday candles. You can blow your birthday candles out, but a big fire willow, you can't blow that out with your mouth. It's not enough air. That's why the big fire trucks have huge, huge, ginormous hoses that they can make water come out of because a big fire, if it's a fire bigger than your birthday candles, there's no way you could blow it out with, with just blowing on it. The firefighters know exactly how to put fires out, and that's what they do for a job. If you have a big, huge fire that, that you started, you can't put that out by yourself. That's why fire is scary. And if there is a big fire, you got to stay away from it and get your family away from it because things can explode and create very dangerous situations. So now that you know how important it is to stay away from fire and not touch matches or lighters or play with them, do you think you'll want to start another fire by yourself? No, Mom. That's pretty scary. I'm sorry. I wasn't thinking about it. But now that you shared your experience and your knowledge with me, I know that it's very important to um, have a grown-up mess with that sort of stuff. Kids are not meant to start fires or play with matches and stuff like that because, Mom, that would be so sad. If our house burned down because I wasn't being smart, then we wouldn't have a place to live like Kalani was saying. And that would be so sad. I'm so sorry that I did that. I just wasn't thinking I didn't know. It's definitely better to be safe than sorry. Yeah, I can see that now. I'm sorry, Kalani, for not listening to you and being rude to you. It's okay. I just want you to be safe, and I want our house to not burn down. Cool. Well, I'm glad you guys learned a valuable lesson today, especially Willow. Make sure if you see any of your siblings or, or anyone playing with fire or matches or anything, you let me know right away, like Kalani Star did. That was very good, Kalani Star. And the... All the fire making stuff, the matches and stuff, is should be out of sight. So I'll make sure to keep all that stuff in a safe hidden area so none of the babies, no one can get into it. Okay, so yeah, let me know if you see any of your siblings doing something that they're not supposed to, both of you. And let me know if you have any other questions that pop in your head. I will be happy to answer them. Okay, thanks, Mom. Yeah, thank you, Mom. You're welcome. Now it's time for you guys to get ready for bed. Okay. okay.